I'm Jody from Robot Farm in New Zealand. Today we're looking at washing salad in the bubbler. The previous newsletter and on YouTube we showed you the specs, which is key for the bubbler to work. Um, just to recap, the salad should be moving all by itself and we've got a dead zone in this corner for any seed holes or rubbish that floats, the rest sinks. We wash one standard container of salad at a time. So here's a tub of baby mizuna. Turn the cover on. So you can see that the salad returning off the side walls and moving on its own accord. And just to recap from last newsletter, we're going to wait, we're going to turn the bubble off and wait for things to settle before taking the salad out. Any soil, caterpillars, little slugs, they, they'll drop to the bottom and then we're going to take the salad off the top. It doesn't need to be off the long. This is a, a really clean number one cut, first cut greenhouse for dinner. So, pull strand, going to take out the salad from left to right. This is the feedback loop. This should always be clean, so rather than coming back in, we're going to tap this guard. Bottom to always be clean, so you can see that there's anything in here that um, we need to separate out. So any really small parts of lettuce, uh, tiny little bits of grasses will float up to this corner where there's no holes in the pressure pipe. It creates a dead zone and it's, um, it's a magic cave. If your problems that float arrive in the corner, we pull screen them out and you get your problems, they soon. So we're waiting again just a little bit. Have a look in underneath the salad to check that any soil in there has dropped to the bottom and now it's a repeat of uh, Scoop it out with the full screen, clean the water before the next cellar, which in this case will be like your